I probably will never uh, stop wanting to solve problems. Well, if I have a pro problem and I just get in the zone and like don't stop till it's done, I can't explain it, I just like want to solve problems. As crazy as this may sound, he was probably about one and a half. We actually got him a computer and he literally would sit there for hours and just play. When he was 11, he found the UW program. And he goes, can I take it? And we're like, yeah, sure. And we signed him up. You could tell right at the start that he had the spark. You know, some people are there at a class because they need to be for their career. And other people are there to really just to, to learn. And Alex is one of those people that really has a love of learning. He felt at home. It was, I mean, it was like he's longed for, to work with other people working on computers. And I think once he got into that program, he, he just kind of fit right in. I give the UW C Sharp program huge credit to where he is today. He realized that for him to be successful, he's going to have to get out of his comfort zone and really start communicating with people. And so he decided he was going to start doing lectures. He actually will go in to a class, takes over the class for the whole day for six periods or seven periods, and actually teaches the class. Talks about his journey, and then at the end, he talks a little bit about coding and some of the programs he took and kind of give them resources and where they can go. I decided to start doing lectures to get girls more interested in the tech field. There needs to be more girls in the class because they balance out the class. My peers will like listen to me like talk about my journey and like get inspired more than like a person that's already been in the industry for a long time because we're the same age. He's very driven. He, he will not give up. Um, I've seen him literally sit there for hours because his code won't work. He will not give up. But he also won't give up on other people to trying to get other people to understand the same thing. I think it's important for everybody to find something that they, they love and um, to give what they love to other people. The impression I got about Alex is that he loves to learn. And it makes me very happy that he's taken what he loves and helping other people by giving himself to that. And as a teacher, you can only hope to inspire people to teach others. That the message that you give to somebody gets broadcast out into the world. Mm -hmm.